That's, uh, that's probably the biggest disappointment for me is we, we start our practices with a thing called fast start, <laughs> where we value, we want to see who's ready to play. So I know who to yell at at the beginning of practice. And um, we didn't start fast on either side of the ball. Really, we had the, obviously the one thing that really sticks out, I think, to most people is, you know, I've got an 87-year-old mother, and she, the first thing she said was, um, y'all got to hang on to that ball when they punt it to you. But yeah, absolutely we did. Uh, we got to do a better job of that. Uh, and that's not okay. Uh, we are all working very diligently to make sure that we get that solved, including me. Uh, I'm, I'm taking over the returners, and, and if, if it's going to happen, it's going to be my fault. Uh, so the thing that sticks out to me is just the contrast in styles between their new quarterback and obviously Paxton Lynch. Paxton was a little bit of, I mean, that dude was a tremendously talented guy. Uh, their new guy is a, also a talented guy. I think he previously started at Tennessee, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, so very, very talented guy. They they went out and got him a good one. Uh, he can throw the football. I mean, they can run. They're they're faster than the guys we just we just faced. And if those guys get as much open space as these guys got, um, you know, a 30-yard run can turn into a 60-yard run in a heartbeat. Uh, they're they're fast. Um, you know, they have a lot of guys that can play a lot of different positions. Um, they move around a lot. And they try to confuse us a little bit, but uh, we just stay disciplined on what we're trying to do and uh, what we're trying to execute on offense. And we're trying to uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely something to think about every time it's, you know, it's that time to go on the road and we fess up on it. Um, we try to get over that hump of, you know, it's, like you said, hearing about those, you know, however long it been since we had a road win. Basically, just going out there this week and knowing that if, uh, if we're going to get some pass team, everything's got to be sound from our stances, our back cuts, our breaks, it's our lane coverage and our eyes, and uh, just listening to Coach Paul and Coach Paul, you know, tell us.